What's going on guys? Today we're looking at the brand new AJ Green. Before we hop into it, if you are new here, hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 10,000 subscribers with the subscribe button, turn notifications. We post daily Madden 21 content. And also do not forget to hit that like button and also leave a link for my Twitch channel down in the description. Um, I'll be live tomorrow night, won't be live tonight because I obviously um, need to make this last video, but um, I'll be live tomorrow night without, without a doubt. I'll post my videos in the morning. And then after those videos go out, we will be live over on Twitch, playing head-to-head, -head, playing viewers, going crazy. So if so, if you haven't stopped by the Twitch channel yet, um, I recommend you do so. Link down in the description. But uh, yeah, that's enough talking. Let's hop right into it. All right, so here is AJ Green. We have him powered up to 92 overall. And then we have Go Deep, uh, 40 out of 50 on him, which puts him at a 93 overall. Um, this dude is 6'4", 210, great athleticism, has 90 speed, um, 94 jumping, which is just crazy on a 6'4 receiver. Um, with 94 catching, 92 catching traffic, 96 spec catch, 90 short, 88 mid, 91 deep route running. Um, after the catch though, with an 83 COD, 88 juke move. So he's actually not terrible after the catch um, as far as like a juke move goes, but not the best COD, but this dude, 6'4", um, physical receiver archetype, which is great for jump balls and great for those crazy catches. Um, if you watch that Vincent Jackson gameplay, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But um, yeah, this AJ Green card is basically like a better version of that Vincent Jackson card. Uh, but uh, yeah, let's head over to the abilities. Um, in the first slot, well, I guess in the X Factor slot, Taylor Rock and Double Me. I don't think we're gonna activate Double Me today, but if we do, um, it'll, it'll be pretty cool to see what it can do. I haven't seen Double Me yet this year, so I'm gonna try as hard as I can to activate it. But um, in that first slot, all he does get is Short In, Second Wind, and Energizer. Um, in that second slot, he does get Reach for it, Red Zone Threat. Um, matchup nightmare slot matic 4 ap not worth it um and yeah as you can see the rest of the stuff there um short in uh short out stuff like that um and in the last slot he does get route tech 3 ap i'm not gonna run it on him today because he does hit um two of those route running thresholds so he doesn't really need it that bad but um, i'm gonna try this card without route tech first but right now we are only rocking red zone threat on him um red zone threat is actually very good this year i've been running it on tony gonzalez and i feel like um, trying on an AJ Green might be worth it because he is 6'4", has that good spec catch, has that good jumping, has that good catch in traffic. So I feel like if we if I do see solo coverage in the red zone and, and, and there's a smaller cornerback on him, it should be a catch almost every single time. So um, we're trying red zone threat today. Does get outside. Um, and what else does he get? Yeah, I think he, yeah, he only gets outside apprentice. Doesn't get wide receiver or slot, unfortunately. But um, yeah, but yeah, this card looks really, really solid. I got a feeling this card is probably gonna stay on the team. I already powered him up and I already purchased him, so I'm probably gonna end up keeping him no matter what happens in today's video because I got a feeling this AJ Green card is gonna absolutely exceed my expectations. These stats are amazing. So uh, yeah, let's just hop right into it. Um, and let's see how this card plays. Let's do it. Here we go. That's our top three. We got Dan Marino, AJ Green, and Deion Sanders. It's definitely nice to see a new face in that top three. Um, and he's got Byron Jones, Leroy Glover, and Andre Johnson. And his name is The Best Gamer 3. The pass. Oh, yeah. He's, he, he's going to get a first down with Rodgers on the ground, isn't he? Oh, hit stick. Pick it up. Hey, let's go, Taylor. Atta boy. Who hits? I'm pretty sure it was a cornerback who hit sticked him, too. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, was that Byron Jones who, got, who caused that fumble? I didn't really see who that was. All right, first play, I'm going to take a shot here with AJ Green. We should have it. Um, depending on the read we get, I might run the ball first. I don't, I know pressure is coming right now. Oh, he dropped everyone back into coverage. I'm going to roll, 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 bite down. AJ Green, go get it. Hey, let's go, baby. Touch on AJ Green. boy. let's go. Man, he looks big, man. 6'4 looks huge right now, man. I mean, a lot of receivers can hit that route running threshold and do have that speed, but there's a very select few that are 6'4 and still have those abilities doing probably gonna be a run nope not a screen nothing here has nothing open at all what's he gonna do here try to hop, try to playmaker the guy um, if that was an accurate pass i'm telling you right now that was an interception oh, here we go watch the corners go to the corner route and he throws an interception this should be a pick boy. okay Isaiah Simmons, i see you will he quit will he quit this guy has no answer for me um guy can't do anything on offense he's gonna stay in the game though i'm not gonna oh he leaves the game all right we'll hop in another game though we're hopping into another one all right, here we go. That's his top three. He's got 96 Sam Mills, Mike Vick, and Reggie Wayne. And we got Dan Marino, AJ Green, Deion Sanders. What's his name? Joey XYLJ. Okay, Joey XYLJ. Let's do it. All right, here we go. He's coming out here in I form close. Uh, my signature formation. Run stretch. Oh, boy. boy. Let's go, Preston Smith. You shouldn't be on the field, but you still made a play for me. He's going to flip it probably. Flip it maybe. Flip it. Flip it maybe. Possibly flipping it. 
That's a pass. Oh, he's running the beater. Oh, he's oh, okay. Okay. I, I mean, you had the beat. You would have had the beater open if you just waited a little bit longer. Yeah, I'm getting no huddle. I got to call a timeout. I'm not even in my right defensive formation. I feel so exposed right now. Form close. Bring Simmons down. Fill that hole, Simmons. Let's go. Blow it up. Atta boy. Let's go, Taylor Mays. Fourth and short. Ezekiel Elliott is not looking good right now. I might run commit this, actually. And if it's not a run commit, I'm going to blow it up. I'm going to blow it up. Motion's at the receiver. Let's see what he does. It's 100% going to be a pass, right? There's no way. Okay, that's what I thought. Pass. It was underneath. Damn. I knew it was going to the tight end, man. Good play. I got a feeling this is going to be a uh, not a run. Okay, it might be a run. Okay, yeah, good play action. Here, here, here's the beater. Good work. Let's go pick it off. I mean, like, you can't beat me with my own plays. I'm going to fall, though, because I want to feed AJ Green. But, like, you can't beat me with my own playbook. It doesn't work like that, man. It's not possible. Right now, let's see what happens. Let's want to get AJ Green open. AJ Green, let's go. Good block right there. Cut up field. AJ, you're such a fighter. Oh, he would have fell forward, too. If that second guy didn't drag him back, we would have had that. Which is, I don't like the corner, actually. The corner's the bad read here. Let's just put him on a little zig route. Um, he should be able to sink below the zones here and get wide open. He kind of pressed up pretty well right there. And we get pressed really... Wait, well, AJ Green, what are you doing, my guy? Bro, did you see what happened with AJ Green on that, on that zig route? I've never seen that happen before. He got pressed so hard that, like, he had no chance of even coming back. He runs iPhone close. He knows... I mean, I would expect a run here too, but because this is a wide receiver gameplay, the bomb is being tossed. Hopefully our edge protectors can hold on. Let's go. We kind of play good defense. I'm just going to hit Tyreek. Is that Tyreek? Yeah, catch a Tyreek. Had a boy. Let's go. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't want to risk uh, turning that ball over on downs or having to go for it on a fourth. So we had Tyreek open. We're going to hit him. If he makes the wrong read. We're either going to have um, AJ Green or Reggie Bush wide open. Dot that. Let's go. Good work. Yeah, yeah, no, we're doing this. Motion corner, motion corner. Where's my motion corner at? I'm not going to get it off in time, but we're going to try to. Oh, no, it's going to be very close. Come on, come on, get there, get there, get there. Here's one-on-one -on -one coverage. The ball's being thrown. We'll get it, AJ. Red zone threat. Oh, damn, the second guy came and helped. He's probably going to be in that same defense, and that second guy's not going to be there to help him anymore because he has to be on that flat route, you know? AJ, go get it. Oh, damn, I'm, I'm animating every time. Make a play. Show your yard scenario. We sub in Marcus Mariota just to get us a first down. That's all we need. All we need is the quick Marcus. Just give us one yard, fall forward. I believe in Marcus enough. And if, if he comes out and the box is stacked, we can pass it. But yeah, it's not. Okay, we're, we're run right up the middle right now with Marcus. Let's go. Oh, Timmy, touchdown too. Atta boy, Marcus. Let's go, man. I love having Mariota have backup, man. He's a very expensive backup, but he does things like that. That's why I like him. Here's, I'll go to the screen, screen play. And he has no one in front of him. Oh, he's going to get out. Okay, nice work. Nice work, Isaiah. He almost converted too. I, I'm gonna play man. I'm gonna play man. Watch underneath the tight end. Oh, double move for the tight end, and he dropped it. Yeah, this guy's in. Oh, he caught. Oh my! He's out here running just no huddles. He's really no huddling me right now. I'm getting no huddled. Like, what is going on? What is this guy doing? He goes to play action again. He's in. He's in a playmaker. The tight end. Off with Vic. Oh my. Okay, this no huddle offense. I'm not a fan of it. I run. Oh, it's an end around. End around. Oh, it's a good, that's a real, that play's really good. Yeah, that play's, he had like two good seal blocks and that guy sealed the outside guy and he went right through the hole. It's a really good run play. I may have to start running those plays for Marcus. I th I'm pretty sure this guy's just playing underneath coverage. So he should have this to AJ. Roll, 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 roll. AJ, no, who is that? Oh, he's running, oh, oh, AJ. No, I shouldn't have swerved. Oh, I shouldn't have swerved. He caught up to me. Damn, that, that was my fault. Okay, Denzel Ward. He, he he is faster than AJ Green, so I mean that is fair. That is fair. Damn, now we got a real game. I should have swerved it, man. I should have just agged it, cause he is six. Ah, that, that, that one's my fault. I wish I could have that one back. We're on Marcus Peters, empty backfield, double move has nothing. Oh, middle of the field. Taylor Mays should play that and pick that off. Taylor Mays is actually goaded, man. I don't know. Taylor Mays just the, has the vertical of just I, I I don't know how he even gets up that high sometimes, bro. He's he's glitchy as hell. I'm gonna try it. I mean, he has 96 spec catch, and I mean, he is 6'4 with 93 jumping. I mean, the odds have got to be in our favor if there is single coverage, right? They got to be. Roll, 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 roll. Oh, my God. We might have it. Holy. Let's go, AJ. Oh, my God. AJ so clutch. End of the half. AJ Green touchdown. Let's go on the beater, man. Let's go, baby. I'm not sure how that beat cover for, but it somehow did. Let's go, man. Big W. AJ Green really might be the best receiver in the, in the game right now. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like, he actually might be the best receiver in the game. You can't name another receiver that, I mean, besides Calico, I guess Calico is the only close guy because, I mean, they're both 6'4", and height does matter on, like, release this year, 
Oh, as, I, as I'm about to get a fumble. Fall, fall, fall. Is he going to quit? He better quit. I just got a fumble. He tried hurtling, though, to be fair. He's really about to quit the game. AJ Green, three receptions for 84 and a touchdown. So that is going to do it for the AJ Green gameplay. And I know I've only used him for a few games, but... I can tell that AJ Green is probably a top two receiver in Mutt right now. It's either him or Calico for that top spot. But um, AJ Green is absolutely amazing. Has that speed, has the size, um, has the jumping, um, has the animations, has the spec catch. Um, all you really have to do is put go deep on him and it turns into an all around monster um, because he does hit that deep route running threshold um, as well as the short route running threshold. So he, so he can kind of do everything. Um, you, you can run him underneath and he's making people miss with 88 juke move. Or you can run him over the top, and as you saw in the gameplay, um, we had two touchdowns on those big post routes. So, um, honestly, if you like running those big over-the-top post routes, I think go deep is a staple or definitely necessary for you because it helps a lot of those receivers that have that short and mid-route running hit that deep route running threshold. So, um, I think go deep right now is probably my favorite chemistry in the game, and it also does add throw power. Um, which is very, very important for your quarterback this year. But um, yeah, if you are able to get your hands on this card, I recommend you do it. Um, I bought him for around 430k earlier on Xbox. So, so if you do want to get this card, you're gonna have to either get him in the auction house or pull him. Yeah, if you are new here, hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications. If the video helped you out, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that like button. And uh, yeah, as always, I'll see you boys in the next one.